we're coming to you from Davis Middle School this morning, San Antonio Independent School District School. This is Anita O'Neill. She is the principal. How are you doing? Good morning. Hello. How are you? Thank you for letting us come on out and see this school. This is wonderful. Thank you. Pleasure to have you here at Davis Middle School. We're here in the Smart Lab at Davis. It's a technology class, mm -hmm. and this particular uh, classroom was funded. It's new to the campus. Uh, it was funded through the 2010 bond, and so we're the first middle school in San Antonio Independent School District to have a STEM lab. And it is wonderful. As a matter of fact, we're going to take a look at it right now. Thank you so much. Thank I'm going you. to leave you for a little bit because there's some neat stuff in here. All right, this is Mr. Jaramillo. Roy Jaramillo, how are you doing, sir? Good to meet you, sir. Thank now, you. Tell us about some of the things that the kids are doing. For example, off to the left there, what is that? Well, we've got a, a Connect Tower here that the students are putting together. They uh, build this device. Um, and uh, what they do here is they design from scratch uh, on paper and then they design it on computer and then from there they go out to try to figure out the different angles that they're going to need to have the uh, the balls to move the roller coaster device. That is neat. So they're practicing on that. Now this over here, meanwhile, what is this? What is your name? My name is Brandy Vargas and this is our robot. You made this robot? Mm -hmm. And And what is your name? Michaela Fortune. And how long uh, did you work on, on building this? Five weeks. Five weeks. Can we see it? Can you turn it on for us? Oh, yeah. Let me get out of the way. Go, go ahead. Look at that. Now, this, this robot is for the SA Best Competition that uh, they're sponsoring here in San Antonio in the next couple of weeks. They'll be competing. Really? Actually, this weekend coming up. This weekend. Well, good luck, ladies. I hope you do well. This is cool. Very cool stuff. Amazing stuff. Now, the, the lab is filled with different kinds of, of uh, areas where they invent, where they create, where they make all kinds of different things. They have different projects, solar related. This one is a, an electric car. Hi, what is your name? Yesenia Miranda. And? Maite Martinez. What do y'all got here? This is a differential gear. It's like a demonstration of a gear that moves various other parts without actually being connected to the motor. And you actually built it yourself? Yes, sir. There it is. So you've got one gear going at one ratio in the middle one, and then you've got another one? Mm-hmm. And that's why they call it? The differential, the differential gear. gear. Amazing. Good. Good stuff. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Okay. And this one is, this is, I love this one. This is a hydrogen fuel cell car. And your name? Victoria. And? Daniel Perez. What have you got here, guys? Uh, hydrogen fuel cell car. The, this battery here uh, makes energy from here to make hydrogen in here, which powers the car. Let's see. Let's see. It actually works. Look at that. That is amazing. And you guys did this all by yourself? Yes, sir. Wow. Wow. All right. Thank you all so much. While we finish up on that, Mr. Jaramillo, you've got a whole other row of different things that we're going to be looking at, and that's coming up in the next segment. Uh, man, you've, you've got your work. Uh, you know, really, you've got a lot of things going on here. And it's an amazing program, for student uh, centered to where the students take uh, charge of their learning. The monkey's right. on their back. All right. And we're going to have more here in just a little bit. Back at Davis Middle School at the STEM lab. Believe it or not, this is something that happens all the time here. And, and actually, they are working on measuring the heart rates and, and things like that, right? Yes, we are. All right. So right now, what is she doing? She had just ran three laps to get her heart rate up. And this is her heart rate on the Rainier software kit on the computer screen. Okay. And so you're squeezing on that so that you'll know they'll be able to get a reading, right? Yes. And what's this and right this here? This is the signal to feel her heart rate pumping in her hands onto the screen, which is connected to the Rainier software mm. kit lab questioning. Excellent, excellent. Ladies, you guys are on top of it. All right, next, Mr. Jaramillo is joining us again, and we're talking about some of the other stuff that's, doing, uh, that's going on, including this, which is uh, got to do with flight, flight, simulating. flight simulating. Exactly. These uh, young men here are uh, practicing how to fly an aircraft. Uh, they get a chance to go from a hang glider to a Cessna, and so forth. Look at that. So they can actually pick the kind of aircraft that they want, and they can actually learn just like that. Exactly. Got these gentlemen out here that are doing some Photoshop editing. Right. And this is neat. What is this? What is your name, sir? Joe Scavio. And what are you doing here? Uh, Reprocipping re circuit. This is a pneumatics project. It uses air to flow through this piloting valve. It flows, goes to this double-acting cylinder, goes into this push valve, and goes. And as this, as this cylinder comes back and forth, it's an electric switch, which triggers this motor that allows the air to come back to this and it keeps going back and forth. And you designed this yourself? Yes, sir. Wow. Wow. And this is, again, part of this new STEM lab. This is part of the software that they have here that allows these kids to really get involved, really, really kind of be a part of this. What is this, guys? Uh, this a Lego Mindstorm NXT robot. And it works? Yes. And you designed this yourself? Yes. Uh, we built it. Um, yeah. Okay. Can I see it? Yeah. 
Let's see your work here. Here we go. And it's off. What's it powered by? Uh, it's battery. Yeah, it's, it's a battery. It's a rechargeable battery. And you put it together. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Congratulations. All right, the next thing we have over here. What is this, guys? This is a garage band. And what is your name? Andrew Rendon. And? Aaliyah. Okay, you're gonna, can it play something for us? Is that what you guys do with this? Yes. Yeah. So this is the garage band here. Okay, so this is some of the software that's designed right here. Yes. Oh, yeah, you got headphones on. Well, you, can you hear it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, good. So that's that. All right, and this is awesome. This has to do with laser technology. Your name? Ishay Malone. And? Michaela Rivera. All right, show us this. This is really cool. You're really going to like okay. this. Turn out the lights and let's see what's going right, on here. Okay. Okay, what's it doing here? Um, it's... <laughs> the lasers are bouncing back from the mirrors onto that um, sensor, and if I move it just a little bit, you can hear me talk on the microphone. There you go. Just a little. Oh, because that's a that's a speaker that's going to pick that yes, up. Yes, and that is connected to the speaker right there. Oh, yes. Maybe if we can move it over a little. Gotcha. All right, well, while they're working that out, again, this is a STEM okay, lab so. at Davis Middle School. There you go. There it comes. There it goes. Now okay. I can hear you. A little bit, yeah. There, there you go. go. Great. Excellent. Ladies, very good. Mr. Jaramillo, it's wonderful. I really like what you guys do here. Uh, uh, again, I'm very impressed with the kids. This is at Davis Middle School. It's the STEM lab here, and it's a smart lab project. And, again, we thank you for letting us come on out and joining you today. Thank you for coming.